Hello, my name is Chuck Clayton. I'm the author of the book, The Rediscovery of Common Sense. It's a guide to the lost art of critical thinking. The left brain, right brain crossover. The left hemisphere of the brain is used for logical, analytical, rational, and objective reasoning. The right hemisphere is used for intuitive, subjective, and holistic thinking. Using only one part of the brain is denying oneself the full power of the decision-making process. Many people are fully capable of using both parts of their brain to make sound, rational, and logical decisions that they feel good about. The left brain, right brain crossover is worth developing. People only use their left brain and work with facts, data, and logic without feelings to make decisions are missing the richness of using their emotions. These individuals deny their feelings because they believe that facts, data, and logic always produce better results than feelings and emotions. Feelings are an integral part of the human condition. Accepting and embracing them during decision making ensures that you will feel good about your decisions now and later. On the flip side, those who only feel their answers miss the importance of backing up those feelings with information and common sense. Learning the facts and data frequently saves a great deal of money, time, and heartache. It can be scary to learn the facts and data for someone accustomed to basing decisions on feelings. However, moving out of one's comfort zone and using the left side of the brain ensures balanced and sound decisions. There are many amazing people who have accomplished much with a strong left brain, right brain crossover. For example, Alan Bean was a Navy test pilot, the lunar module pilot on Apollo 12, and fourth man to walk on the moon. These jobs require strong left brain thinking with logical, analytical, rational, and objective reasoning. After resigning from NASA, Alan Bean became a full-time artist. He paints Apollo's human adventure that is both visionary and historic. Art requires strong right brain thinking using intuitive, subjective, and holistic thinking. Florence Nightingale is another example of a person with an excellent left brain, right brain crossover. Many of the nurturing qualities of a good nurse are right brain traits. Her work as a statistician to show the importance of sanitary conditions in healing the sick and wounded used her left brain powers. If you would like to learn more, please go to my website www.chuckclayton.com. Thanks for stopping by.